Um, so, other things that I love that my audience doesn't remember. <laughs> um, I, so, like, I, I've actually asked this question before, and then I just, like, don't play the song. And I, like, say, do you, does you know who Helen Hunt is? Yeah! yeah. You know who Helen Hunt is? And my audience is like, Hunt me? Mm. And I'm like, Twister, mad about you? As good as it gets? Like, mm -hmm. Um, and, uh, so this was actually the first song that I ever released on, on, on the world. Um, I had written songs before, but they were bad. Um, and actually there's one song that's on one of my albums that I wrote before this. I'm not gonna play that song. And, uh, but this is the, uh, this is the first song that I, I, like, wrote and then released, and people were like, that's good! And it felt so good. It's about how much I love Helen Hunt. And it's, as Will Wheaton says, it's not about what you love, it's about how you love it. And I love Helen Hunt really creepily. <laughs> the first time I saw you was the day... The first, that's the wrong chord. The first time I saw you was the day that I hit puberty. You played a beautiful girl, shunned by society. It wasn't your fault, you just smoked one lace doobie. That after school special made me want to never do PCP. Oh, Helen Hunt. Helen Hunt, you make my heart do acrobatic stunts. You stand and face the brunt of the twister of my burning want. Helen Hunt, you know I'm mad about you. Well, I saw you naked in the water dance. It was as good as it gets in my pants. So I have to, I, sorry, I'm going to stop in the middle of every song, apparently. Uh, I, they, that joke, it seems much dirtier than it is. Because it's a joke, so Maureen Johnson, uh, who may, some of you may know of, or more personally, um, she is a young adult author and famous Twitter person, and she decided one day that every book title is better if you have In Your Pants to the end. Like, The Lord of the Rings in your pants, or The Two Towers in your pants, or Just a Geek in your pants. And so, uh, that also works for movie titles, of course, it's as good as, you, as, good it, uh, as good as it gets in your pants. So, it has a double meaning, which makes it, for some reason, a little less creepy. <laughs> no, no, okay. And for the, uh, as good as it gets in my pants, and for that, I really want to thank you. Your husband's name was Hank, right? Well, my name's Hank, too. Helen Hunt, Helen Hunt, you make my heart do acrobatic stunts. You stand and face the brunt of the twister of my burning what? Helen Hunt, you know I'm mad about you. Oh, once an ex-best friend of mine, he said he couldn't see how an old and ugly actress couldn't mean so much to me. Well, a minute later, looking down at him bleeding in the snow, I asked him, who is best comedy actress? Four years in a row, it was Helen Hunt. Helen Hunt, you make my heart do acrobatic stunts. You stand and face the brunt of the twister of my burning what? Helen Hunt, you know I'm mad about you. Helen Hunt, you know I'm mad about you. Uh, my, the Nerdfighters, the, the audience uh, of our video blog community, uh, who I hope they represent in this room. Um, oh, I saw you all. Um, decided uh, to take it upon themselves one year to make it sure that Helen would see the, the song. <laughs> and eventually, and actually it took like two weeks from like the announcement of the goal to like when Helen Hunt tweeted at me and said, Lovely song, Hank. I'm putting little hearts and stars all over the restraining order. <laughs> and I thought that was pretty great. She didn't come over to my house, though, afterward. <laughs> like I thought she might. <laughs> um, I actually, like, I really did have a really huge thing for Helen Hunt when I was a kid. That's not a lie. I didn't make it up. There's not, not a lot of lies in my music. I'll, I'll stop during the middle of the song every time I lie, though, just so you know. Because apparently that's my thing. Ha, ha, ha.